We're out here at the river. Just hooked the John just hooked the first cat on a frog. Haven't caught any gold eye yet, which is supposedly the hot bait right now. But been pulling some good drag, so. Oh, yeah. he's decent. Oh, I can't. I gotta get him head first. I'm good. Very nice. There we go. Ah, he's probably about 12, 14. Pretty small. They're gonna spawn now. They're about ready to spawn finally up here in North Dakota, so. Get back to you with the measurements on this on this cat. Hey, here's my fish. 33 inches, 14 pounds. Not the fat ones we were catching the last time we were out yet, but it's a good start. Just hooked into the second fish of the day. I got one, John. Doesn't feel very big, but. Yeah. Not very big. Don't get stuck in that mud. Pretty small. Maybe two, three, four pounds. Nice eater. Already about two pounds, I'd say. Don't even know if we're going to bother measuring that guy, but looks like we might be getting another fish over there. So, but um, he's about two pounds, probably 18 inches. I'm not, I'm not even going to measure him at this size, but he's a nice first fish for me on the day anyway. So, actually, I think we're going to keep him. So, this size will taste pretty good. I just hooked into my second, it's our third one. He is pretty small. Nice little guy, another eater. John, you gonna help me? Actually, I'll just flip this guy. Probably gonna be keeping him too. About the same size as the last one. So. He'll be a good size to eat. Hopefully we can get some more, maybe some big ones. Well, right after I caught that small eater, John hooked into what appears to be a pretty decent sized ten. one. Eight, eh, to eight to ten pounder, he says it feels like. Haven't seen it yet. This is again on the frog. Luke over there. Subscriber, cousin. Subscriber and cousin caught us a gold eye. So we're gonna cut that up. And we got these two frogs we've been reusing. This is our fourth fish. So hopefully we can get into some nice ones tonight. But what do you think of it? Uh, he's not too bad. Yeah, eight to 10. He'd be a good eater too. Yeah, he's an eater. Little, oh yeah, he's an eater for sure. I can get his head to me. There we go. Yeah, he's too big for an eater, but. Nice one. Get the measurements on this to you guys. Hopefully we can catch some more. I mean, we've only been here for probably a half an hour and we've already caught four, so. Shaping up to be a decent day. I'm gonna show you. I'm gonna show you guys. Got a gold eye right here. This is a great catfish bait, especially for this time of year. Just gonna basically cut them into chunks, throw it out there on a catfish rod, hopefully get lucky with some more big cats. Got uh, measurements on this catfish. 32 inches, 15 pounds. Pretty healthy cat. Nice big belly. Yep, getting ready to spawn any day now. So the spawn started a little further south. So, I mean, hopefully we can catch some more. Well, Luke's rod he just put in with gold eye. Hooked him up. Here, he's not fighting very hard, so. All right, here, grab him. It's not that big, I don't think, but here, I'll tighten your drag a little bit. 
All right. All right. Luke's hooked up, his first cat of the year. Been here, what, for 45 minutes? Not even now, just about a little over half an hour. Oh. <laughs> Hello. Hey, bring him to me. All righty. Oh yeah, he's a decent size. Oh, I can't reach that far, but this will be a pull. Just drag. Oh, right in the mud. Oh, there we go. Nice eater right there. About six, seven pounds. He'll be coming home with us. All right, we'll get the measurements on and we'll get right back to you. All right, I got a nine pounder here, 26 incher. 28 inches. 28 inches. <laughs> What's yeah. you gonna do with them? You gonna throw them back or keep them? I'm gonna throw them back and I'm gonna let them catch them in 10 years again. <laughs> All right, well, John, I'm helping John out. He just hooked into another one with his rod. Here, hold it and I'll get your bell off. Okay. Just, you know, keep tension on him. He doesn't feel too big, but you never know. Oh crap, is that my the rod? I literally just put that rod in. But getting the net on this guy, this action has just been ridiculous. This is a new spot we found. And it seems to be really paying off. What is this on? The frog again? Haven't had the gold eye out for too long though, so I already caught one on the gold eye. Luke did. So, yeah, what do you think? Over 10, 10 pounds? Yeah, probably 14, 15. <laughs> you never know. It is the Red River, so. All right. When, when you, you know. I don't think anyone's been here in a long time because we found a Colt can from 1992. 96. 96. Still, it's 21 years. <laughs> All right. Hang on. Luke's got something on his bait rod over there. Red horse, get him up. Get him up, keep him. That'll make some good cut bait. Red horse suckers. So now we got three baits. Great bait. We'll show you the sucker on camera after we get this in. Drag him. Oh, boss. It doesn't. Oh, yeah, that's a nice one. Bring it. Ah. Oh. Oh, I. I can't. Oh. He's beached. I can't net him. There, there we go. This one is gonna be in the teens. And Luke's hooked up. You have your bell off. Alrighty. Put the boat in the ground. I got the bell. John, John, open your belt. Okay. okay, I'll take him up. Jeez. All right, now get him out of the net. I'm gonna need that net. Dang right you will. It's a 40 pound. <laughs> oh. Here. Double header folks. Alright. That one's gonna be in the high teens, the one that John caught. <laughs> uh -oh. Yeah. Oh yeah. Alright. John, you wanna help him out with his bell? <clears throat> you want to get these on this on your phone? A picture of this on your phone, Luke? This fish? Alright. Get him head. Get his head. Holy blade! <laughs> boy. Hey. Right. Oh, yeah. Hey. Oh, yeah. He's a, he'd be a good eater, I think. Yeah. 
Yeah. He'll be eight, 10 pounds. Get back to you with the measurements on the two fish. We got a double header here. There's the measurements on theirs. And I got a third rod going over there. So it could be a triple header. We'll have to hurry up. So here, mine's a 35, 17 pounds. Mine's a 32, 11. It's a beast. We're going to release them both or what? Yep, both are going to be released. All right. So now it looks like I got to watch this rod. I don't know if he's any, very big, but hey, John. this is that red horse sucker. This is also pretty good bait, usually in the spring and fall, but it'll probably work in the summer too, if we need anything after we get done with those gold eyes. So hopefully we can catch some more fish, but we've only been here less than an hour and we've already caught like what, six or eight. So pretty good day so far. Luke just hooked into another one. Okay, go get done. Got size to them? Mm. Oh. Yeah, it seems to be pretty good. Oh, yeah. And John's gonna get down there for the net job on this boy. Mm. <clears throat> oh. All right, there we go. Your line went slack for a second. Try to keep that from happening. It's only been here an hour and a half. Okay. Not an hour and a half? Yep. All right. How about this is 30 plus pounder? Oh yeah, that's a little guy. He's an eater. <laughs> Another probably, oh yeah, probably three pounds. So yeah, good eater. Not gonna bother measuring or weighing him, just gonna toss him in the pail. One more to go home with us for a nice catfish dinner. Get a glance at him in the net. All right, I was on gold eye again. His Hopefully, bigger than his bite. Yeah, that's for sure. Hopefully we can get some more big ones, but these eaters are fun too. This is on that red horse. Chunk of it. Chunk of the red horse. Look, watch that rod. Ooh. This is by both both teams dollars. Hey, guess. don't grab your rod up there. Hey, stay back. I gotta be able to get that close to net and I'm not going down there where it's muddy. Get my boots stuck. Jeez, all right. Oh yeah, he's a good one. Yeah, take it if he gets down. Yeah, hang on, not yet, but you know. If he gets down. If he takes it down, take him. Get him? Oh yeah, this guy's. It's a nice fish. Yeah, he's got him up there. And then you can claim your second fish in a second, John. Oh. What is this, like nine or ten on the date? I'll have to watch the video. Set it down here. I'll have to get this one out of the net so we'll get his other one in there. Not yet. No, I gotta get this out of it. All right, there's that. I'll net him. I got him. Eater. I'm not gonna measure this one. This one might be about three and a half to closer to four, somewhere in there. <laughs> So I got my double here, just a small one, and a 33-16. Nice, All right, nice yeah, it's a nice fish. We'll get them back. Get back to you guys with more. I keep reeling. Luke's got a small one now. He thinks it is. John's gonna get down for the net job. This is on that little sucker minnow. No, that we no, cut. No. It's on um, go a piece of sucker, actually. All right, we put a piece of sucker on there. Boy, he has some torque on him, boy. <laughs> mm. Probably she's a little chilled. All right. Oh, hello. All 
All right, that'd be an eater. I'm just getting a bite on this rod. John's got a bite down there. Luke's gonna get the release on that guy. I got this guy. All right, John, give me some help with the bell, please. Right. He's coming, oh, he's decent. Got a little bit of fight to him anyway. Not much though. Yeah. There we go. He's probably close to eight. Just a guess. Alrighty, that was my first one in a while. I got a release on my 26 inch six pounder and I gotta get over there because John just hooked another one, so. How does he feel? Small. Small? Yep. Oh. You even wanna measure this guy? He's about 23, 24 inches, probably about four pounds. His other rod's been getting some bites, so get the release on this guy real quick. Here he is. I just hooked into one. John's getting one down there. Luke, get the net. Hurry up, this one's decent. Oh yeah, he's all right. Probably my best one of the day. He's literally at the shore. Head first. John missed his down there. Oh, uh, it broke. Huh. That's a professional net job. Yeah, get him up here. Up, back, back, back. Get the measurements on this guy real quick. Not, don't really need to, but get back to you guys with him. Hopefully some more. This guy was 23 inches, four pounds. Get a quick release on this guy. John just hooked one down there. I'm getting a little bit of action on this rod too. How does he feel, John? Decent. Decent. Luke, can you get the net? Mm -hmm. uh, I'm not sure. I got one here too. Not very big, but. Oh, he's actually not too shabby. Look, here comes this one. Ah, uh, ah, uh, I was gonna say, don't even net him. But, not even gonna measure this guy. Yeah, look, get, jeez. Make it a triple header, maybe. Okay, here's the two, two ones from double. I caught that one, he got that one, he got the bigger one. This one's about 24, four pounds. This one about 18, about two pounds. Just how it is. Hopefully we can get a couple more before we gotta leave. I just hooked into one. I literally had this rod in for probably less than a minute. Feels like he's got a little bit of size to him, but. Not really, actually.
He's a little guy. He's fighting decent though. Oh, not too bad. There we go. Another channel cap. Yeah, close to ten probably. Eight, nine, Eight, nine yeah. Oh, we'll mess him up. Yeah, we'll get him. Alrighty. Get a measurement on him, get back to you. Probably about leaving now, so. Get the measurements on this. Well, that last fish I caught, 28 and a half inches, nine pounds. Get the release on him. And might get one more before we leave.